It's so awesome to have you here today, Ashiana. We are discussing and talking about elevation real estate and elevation real estate rentals. Um, a lot of people don't realize that we do rentals and we have you who is the rock star that runs the whole rental side of Elevation and is absolutely out there uh, slaying dragons every day. And um, we so appreciate everything that you do. And it's great to be able to kind of talk to you today about uh, how we do it and what we do and how we, how we put it all together. Happy to tell you more. Ah, awesome. So I'm gonna kind of share my screen and I'll jump in and we'll kind of use our website as a, a way to talk about it. Um, so when we when you go to our website, elevationrealestate.com, if you go over here to landlords and click on the landlord tab, it kind of walks into the renting process. And I'll let you you talk about it because this is this is your world. Ash. So so tell us. So essentially, the first step we would do is when we get introduced um, to a potential landlord is you know, have a look at the property. And the first step is to comp out the property because, you know, we want to get the best price for them, um, especially comparing to if they were getting a higher price before or if they have been renting for a while and, you know, they were renting and it was rent control, you know, to get them up a better price. Get them up. And, and a lot of times we, we meet, um, we seem to uh, get a lot of landlords who um, either used to do it themselves um, and they're having a lot of difficulty being able to take care of it because of the demands that are on them for showing and marketing and all that kind of stuff. Uh, and they're kind of, um, they're looking for a reliable service to let go of that process to somebody that they, they kind of know, like, and trust and, yes. and with a robust uh, system. Yeah. Uh, so, well, when you go into our website, they're uh, elevationrealestate.com, you click on landlords, you get uh, here, Big thing with our process is we're, we're a flat fee, right? Yes. So um, the, the entire process is just a standard fee. There's the no percentages fee, yeah. involved or, or any other kind of stuff. So it's exactly. very predictable. Yes, and, very and, transparent. Um, you know, it is what it is. Perfect, perfect. So, you know, you're pricing out the property and getting, you know, figuring out kind of what the rent is going to be is kind of the first kind of step. That's the first step, yeah. And then, and then we all, we, we talk about this, I'm cutting in probably eating up more time on, 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 on your airtime than I probably should, but I, I always love the, the analogy of the, the kind of speedometer on yeah. kind of how we, we judge, right, with a, with a rental rate. And that's if you put a, a rental out and the phone's ringing off the hook, like just crazy, you have it priced too low. Um, if you put it out there and it's flat and we're not getting any interest at all, um, it's priced too high. And it's ultimately trying to find that middle spot, that just nice cruising speed where we're generating, you know, four or five leads uh, a day. Um, and then that's something where you have it priced kind of just right, right? That's mm -hmm. kind of the sweet spot, right? Yeah, yeah. And we also sometimes like to tease it online. We'll, we'll just put it on one place to test a higher price. If I get bites on that, then, you know, I'll post it everywhere and market it everywhere at that price. Else we'll, we'll reduce it so that it's not overly exposed online at a higher price. Um, and we can still gauge where the market is. Oh, that's beautiful. So you kind of tease it out sometimes that yeah. way. Yeah. Right. Cool. Then marketing. You handle all the marketing, right? Yes. So we do everything. We, we will post it to Zillow if you like. They do charge an extra $10 now a week. Um, but we find that it's really effective in reaching a lot more people. Um, you know, when I post it on Zillow, I know that I'm going to get, if it's at the right price, at least five to six leads a day um, on average. So that's definitely something I like to do. Um, and we do Zillow, Craigslist, and Realbird, and it syndicates to, to all of the websites, essentially. Just so right. And it goes to apartments.com yeah. and Zumper, and it just goes out everywhere. It's exactly. A, exactly. Um, and then you do all of the showings and open houses and all yes. that kind of stuff. Yes. So landlords are not involved in no. having to do any of the marketing or mm -hmm. any of the um, and then there's some premium kind of packages. There are some snazzy things you can do with the marketing, which we'll, we'll get into towards the end a little bit, just so we can kind of knock through this process. Yeah. Uh, tenant screening. 
this is this is huge, right? Mm -hmm. um, it's, it's one of the most important parts, you know, of what we do because we want to make sure that you know they are who they are. Um, you know, they have been good tenants in the past. They work where they say they work, and you know they're reliable employees, and they will be employed, you know, at least for the next year. So these are all things that we have to do our due diligence with and, and find out about them. And um, and there's there's quite a lot involved, and we don't outsource that. Like that's something mm -hmm. that's completely uh, it's our process, and it's all in house. And you're basically the one doing every phone call yes. and every email and every verification. So, exactly. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so we, is, we look under the hood and, and we make sure that everything you know looks right. And I'm going to switch over here to our rental application uh, because it is quite robust. Uh, yes. We do get into you know what property they're looking to rent, their personal information, their housing. We love you know we want to know the current, but we also want to know the past because a lot of yeah. times past landlord can be more honest in what they're yeah. like as a tenant. Um, and, and not only that, sometimes they're not staying for very long at the current landlord. Sometimes it's you know six to eight months. So and we want to know why they want to move, and so which is why we look at previous employer and previous landlord because they're probably there for a longer time. So we can get a better idea of you know hey you know what were they really like? What what sort of a tenant are they? Yeah, yeah. get a whole profile. Then yeah. of course we've a lot of uh, questions about kind of their thought process, kind of to get a sense of. How long do we think we might have them as a tenant and that yeah, kind of stuff? Exactly. Um, and uh, and then by their signature on the bottom of this, it gives us permission to be able to verify all the data, exactly. which is uh, which is great. Okay, yeah. cool. So um, so then once we you, we get a, a tenant, yeah. um, we don't just blindly pick the tenant. We basically we will offer the tenant that we are recommending to the landlord with the reasons why we think there'll be a good tenant. Exactly. Yeah, and, and sometimes we, we get to... multiple applications, so, you know, who are, who are equally good. So, you know, we will we'll submit it to the landlord, give our thoughts and suggestions, and ultimately the decision lies with the landlord and we're there to, you know, help them make that decision. Yeah, okay. Um, and then uh, there's the whole lease signing. We put together, we use um, the, for San Francisco, um, we do okay. use the SFAR uh, or not the SFAA San Francisco yeah. Apartment Association at uh, lease, which is the cutting edge up to date yes. uh, up -to lease. Today. Yeah, yeah. Um, and so we use the most current one, and um, you know we do all of that, you know, online via DocuSign, um, so it makes it easy for everybody. Um, yeah. and, you know, and then our application is all filled out online exactly. uh, by a DocuSign and completed. So our, exactly. our our whole process there is digitalized. Exactly. And anything yeah. is tweaked, like, you know, some landlords have particular house rules that they want people to abide by or particular addendums, you know, that they want, you know, the, the garden watered once a week and they want, want that, you know, to be included and things like that. So we, we you know, we specialize it according to what what the landlord wants and and do we do the lease according to that and then for the east bay then we use the 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 uh california association of realtors yes. uh lease which yes. is the state the statewide lease yeah. um that covers that area um perfect and then once we get all the the initial rent and that kind of stuff we just kind of we hand them off to uh to the landlord and you, yes. there you have your, your new tenant in place mm -hmm. and the second month of rent, they will be paying to you and, and um, it's all up and running. Yeah, it's all done. We facilitate Perfect. the key handover and all of that stuff and then, um, and then we step up. Perfect. Now, um, there's premium packages, professional photography and virtual staging. Yeah. So um, here's, a, here's a, a, an example of something that is just, um regular yeah. photography that we added in then yes. the virtual staging exactly it makes a really big difference um because a lot of the rentals we see online are endless pictures of empty rooms um yeah. so a it, it helps us stand out it gives people an idea of you know the space and where things will go um so we've had a lot of success with this this, this is all virtual this is it's a virtual. this is this is a vacant room that yes. has been virtually virtually staged exactly and and then a lot of times these are places that we can reuse these pictures then in the future, or we give them to the landlord, give if, them to uh, the landlord yeah. if they want to reuse them. Exactly. And uh, 
how much how much does it cost to, to virtually stage so it's uh, about property it's it's hundred dollars um 99 for about five rooms so it's it's you know it's a very good investment um you know wow so it's a hundred bucks and you can you can stage up to five rooms yes for that's amazing yeah okay perfect so um well that's kind of i'm gonna turn on like that's kind of it in a nutshell it's yeah. uh, it's a lot of work we make it easy uh, we make it easy yeah. and, and it and it, it's definitely i see how hard you work like it's it's uh it's a lot it's um, a lot of work but i think it's it's very satisfying um you know when you meet the right um you know when it's like matchmaking and the you know when tenants love the landlords and it's it's a relationship for them that you know for years that they have so we want yeah. to do our job it's nice to bring them together exactly and bring their and there exactly. is there, there are good fits for kind of when you you get into this which exactly. is so how how do people find us again um ash if somebody's interested and they want to use um use uh, your services how do they find so you we're online um at our website um and, and, and I'll show that website again, just uh, so everybody sees it. We're actually, over here, Elevation. Yeah. Um, go to the main page, elevationrealestate.com. Exactly. And we have some numbers up here. But if they want to find you in particular, they just go to the about us, meet yeah. the team, and um, there, look, there you are, right there, Thank Ash. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and then click here, and all your contact information is right there. Okay. All right. Let's uh, bring it up. You can uh, hit the contact contact through the website, um, and then your your phone number is right there. That's actually your cell phone number. Yes, but it shows yeah. up. We, we should correct that. It shows up is it's not your home number. No, it's your, it it's might your as cell well phone be. number. <laughs> yeah, it might as well be. Yeah. awesome. So um, so perfect. So uh, as always, you're great. We Thank so appreciate you. all the hard work that you do. Thank you, Ash. And um, great talking to you. Yeah, I'll talk to you later. See you during the week. Bye.